It took Cal senior Spencer Hall a while to get used to the sport of rowing. Coming from a football and track background at Eden Prairie High School in Minnesota, Hall wasn't used to the endurance element of the sport. He said he focused on the field events as a track athlete and wasn't accustomed to the long-term demand rowing requires. But Hall obviously is now comfortable in the water as he is a member of the top boat for the number one bears. Rowing was a real transition from putting points on the board to who can race the fastest. And I had done track, but I always tried to do the shorter events because I didn't ironically like the endurance ones. So I tried to do either the field events or, you know, the 400 or something like that. But transitioning to rowing where you had to push your body for six minutes was a crazy concept to me because that was, I mean, that was even longer than a mile. And the mile was the longest thing in the world to me. So going from that, it was, it was a whole new experience and allowed me to push myself in ways that I hadn't really been able to push myself. Like football, you got to rest every, you know, five seconds and track, you got to stop after hopefully, you know, 40 seconds or 50 seconds. So just totally new way to push myself and it's been really fun. Hall never expected to spend much time in a boat in college. An accomplished poet at a young age, Hall thought he'd immerse himself in literature. But despite battling an injury when he first arrived in Berkeley, Hall has put in the hard work to become an integral part of Cal's program. I mean, I would say one of my biggest prides was I grew up as a sort of a prodigy for poetry. And at one point I was the youngest published poet in the state of Michigan. So I always thought that would be my career path and I go into, you know, become a Nobel Poet Laureate. And the way that my life has, the trajectory of my life has changed from poetry and literature to rowing, that's funny because I never thought I'd be here. I thought I'd be, you know, behind a book. Hall and the Bears are coming up on the biggest stretch of the season, beginning with this weekend when Cal hosts number two Washington in a battle of two of the sports heavyweights. The Bears then have the big row against Stanford the following week before heading into the postseason. But for now, Cal is solely focused on the Huskies. Well, it's huge for us because there's, we're two of the you know, pinnacle teams in our sport and they're always in the front of our mind. Like we're always pushing ourselves based off them, you know? As happy as you can, and content as you can be racing with your own teams in practice, you always keep them in the, in, you know, in the forefront of your mind and want to know, okay, yeah, it was a good piece, but is it good enough to beat Washington? So to actually be able to put that, all this work and you know, the, all the races we've done for the last seven months or so, to put it to the test, it's huge. And I think they think the same thing. So I think it's gonna be really fun. Stay tuned next time for another edition of the Olympic Sports Report.